guys. Hey y'all, I'm Jeremy. And I'm Davina. And welcome back to Whoosh Bang Pow. Yeah, we're gonna binge on to the next episode, episode six of the of Defenders. The Defenders. Uh, yeah, last time um, they had killed one of the fingers. Yeah. <laughs> now there's just four. four. Electra is getting her memories back. Uh, Matt's finally spilled the beans. Uh, the worlds are converging. All of the uh, secondary characters are in a room. But it looks like we may have some infighting among the team and some trust issues. On both ends, villains and heroes. Yes. So All get, over the same I person. can't wait. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So, well, it's true. It's, it's kind of it's like, cause they're like, you can't save her. No. She's probably going to turn on you. For sure. And she's actually in that precipice of we don't know which way it's going to go. So, yep, it could be the undoing of everything. So let's find out. We're going to watch The Defenders right, right now. now. Is this a flashback? No. Mm -mm. Oh, she's stewing in her own, <coughs> her own angst. Yep. But I mean, she's on a ticking time clock with pieces falling off the chessboard, so... For sure. Is it the same body she's always had? Because this one's get has cancer, or is, did she just ha get a different vessel? That I, I don't know. Do all of them have the same vessel they were originally in when they left the city, or? Also a good question. God, that was so badass. Okay. I, I love stick. Yeah. Man. My head's not attached. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jessica! Uh, uh. Stop. Do you literally think Danny opened something? And that something is worth dying for. I'm a weapon. I'm not a key. That you know of. What could I possibly open? <laughs> you tell me. Must be why they haven't killed you. They haven't killed me because they want me on their side. No. This G is a weapon. It's true. He was a member of the Hand, an organization formed by lying psychopaths. You can't trust a word he said. That originated in Come On, though. Yeah. Where they I were cast it? out. We only have one move. I mean, come on, Danny. Don't be so dense. Can you please oh. just get on board? What do you mean? To keep the Iron Fist as far from them as possible. Just take a deep breath and calm down. Stop telling me to calm down, Luke. God, stop they acting like a want. child. They want you to be distracted. They, they, they want you to turn on me. This one day wasn't lying. And how do you know? His heartbeat didn't waver, not for a second. And where was his heartbeat when he came up behind me? It's the hand. You know how they can operate. Maybe we should just hide him. We're running out of time. They're hunting our friends, our families, and they're not going to stop there. You heard what he said. This ends with New York in ruins. They want me on their sidelines because I'm the only one who can destroy them. Jess? Well, I don't know about that. Stick How just decapitated him. I'll go back to doing this without you if I have to. Wow. I've already lost one city. Come on, Danny. I'm not losing another. Wow. Me neither. Okay. Really? Yes. Be a leader, Matt. You're gonna try and keep me here against my hair. you're saying, Danny. Oh my god, it's like big brother, little brother. It really is. You sure you want to do this? No, I don't want to, but if I have to. See, when you had to keep your girlfriend oh. secret, we're past that. No, we're not. Danny, we're all on the same side here. It doesn't feel like it. God, Danny, stop being a brat. Don't do this. This is this br this is the Danny I don't like. <laughs> nice. You guys, seriously, I won't let it call. Oh my god. You did not want to do that. I mean, he's the Iron Fist. I don't really know if he's going to win this fight. Oh. oh! Are we really? Wow. Can Jess, can, can she just knock him out? That would be helpful. Someone just knock him out. Enough. Oh! Just... Damn. Don't make me use this. Oh! Shit! 
Damn. Fuck. Sorry about this. Thank you, Jessica. Oh. <sighs> okay. That's the Danny we both don't like. Yes. The one that's a little asshat, brat. Danny has that problem. He acts like a five-year-old and it drives me insane That's the when problem. adults act like children. He's very short-sighted. Extremely short-sighted to a fault. And He's so it's centered. Amazing when it's used humorously. But in this case, it's like, dude, we're not saying we want to put you out of commission. We're saying Putting you in the line of fire is giving them open chance to be able to capture you because they want to use you. You don't even know everything about your powers. The next time you conveniently forget shit that affects the rest of us. You're not exactly an open book yourself, Jessica. What is that supposed well, to mean? Well, no one's digging into your past. So. My past is none of your goddamn business and it's not actively trying to kill us. Well, huh. 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 We need more answers going back to Ooh. the we barely made that last 100% time. true, though. The sparks are just flying oh, off of them. I love it. Oh, my God. The architect, my client's husband, the one your girlfriend tried to kill, he designed the place. What, you think he knows how Danny ties into this? It's worth a shot. Do you think there's a portal in the basement? What about you? At this point, anything's possible. Somebody's got to stay watching. Oh, oh, there's your friendship. Push. Come on, bro, man. Yeah. Please make him grow up faster. He's like a... At you least know what? partially. Yes, I am. Is this a flashback? I think this might be a flashback. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I like them two together, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, she did. She is remembering. Oh. Oh. That's sweet. Damn, that's some love. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like this night. so much. Not me. Got it. Plus, I occasionally help the landlord out. Talk about the mess. It's all right. You should see my place. Hmm. What do you work for? Active crime scene. <laughs> <laughs> and? Now we don't. Oh, he's going to know. He's going to know. Everything okay? Come on, Matt. Yeah, yeah. Matt! Let's go. Being secretive does never work out. Oh, I do love their scenes together, though. Mm -hmm. An operative forgetting it. Oh, <laughs> Look how cute they are. So, it is awful. I need to know about the architect. His wife hired me to find him. He didn't tell her much, especially not about some secret tunnel under New York. A tunnel, it's a hole, straight down. If you could just answer a couple of questions, it'd be a tremendous help. The day job duo. I like them together. Mm -hmm. Damn it, why can't it be Candy? God dang. She's like, I just, I don't understand why her body has cancer if they're immortal. Right? Closed door I'm confused about this something. as well. Mm. Locking me up is not smart. Well. Either's fighting three people that happen to be on your side. Well. Well. Good point. The moment I can refocus my chi, I'm getting out of this chair. Ugh. I'll be waiting. Huh. Man, he's such a five-year-old right now. I mean, what is Stick doing back there? <laughs> Meditating? Uh-huh. I think. I said something about Praying, pull, 
rules and censoring is animal. Then I tuned him out. <laughs> animal. What? He's centering his animal. Hey, why don't you tell me again about how you punched the dragon and got your magic hand? <laughs> During the final trial of Shao Lao the Undying, I plunged my fist into his golden heart. He did me literally! <laughs> <laughs> I mean <sighs> Is he gonna let him? Molten heart, huh? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> using the homework. Yeah. Oh. I like them together so, so much. Awesome. Why can't they be canon? They call him the devil of Hell's Kitchen. And in the silver light, he let Electra die. No, he didn't. I mean... He's either one I faced in battle. He didn't let her die. He she sacrificed him. herself to save him. Yeah, the hand killed Electra. <laughs> Let's just be honest a little bit. Thank you. She's so evil. There's something else you should know. Do what? Oh, it's straight ahead. Oh, yeah. is he yeah. thinking he kept something in the piano? Yep. Uh, I wasn't very good, but... It would be nice if it... I mean, if Youngster could do it. God, I'm thinking of that scene again. Which one? All my babies are gone. Oh my god, don't take me back there. Just give me a second hand. Is he playing his own <laughs> theme yes, music? Yes, he is. <laughs> it's so meta. <laughs> He's so playing his own theme music and I loved it. <laughs> Yes, Jessica. Thank you. Good job, Matt. They make such a good team. Shit. This isn't for the building. No, this is something else. This is something. What below is that? The building. Oh. Oh. No. It is a tunnel. It's at the bottom of the hole. There's something under Midland Circle. Oh. It's to lead them to the stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How'd you know? She's a detective. About, what? About my dad. A crime fighting blind lawyer. I figured there'd got to be a good story there. Huh? Mm hmm. Or a shitty one. He took my case, I took yours. I just think we'll work better together if we trust each other, don't you? That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Huh? Yeah, no, mm -hmm. very good. Ha! Uh. <laughs> I love them together. This is war. Oh, fuck. We need him to win it. We assumed we only had two choices. Wait. Run or fight. What? Well, I found a third option. Wait, what is it? Kill Danny and they don't have... No! No, 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 no! Fuck. I may not like Danny, but I don't want him to fucking die. You won't feel any pain, kid. Did you not learn after you did this with Electra the last time? Oh, wait. Then again, Electra got turned into... Never mind. 
Never mind. With any luck, you'll see it again. I would imagine it's beautiful. Stick. What? No. In this case, yes, Matt has the right idea. There's another way, kid. There are things in this world. I mean, technically, can't just just can just jump up into the. Oh! You can't have him, girl. You know, they get to tell me what to do. Oh. Not enough good tea. Well, wait a minute. How are they still awake? Oh! Oh my god! Oh. Wait, why do you hesitate? Wait, what the hell's going on? He Dick hesitated. also doesn't want to kill her. Uh. She has also shown that she does have. She is getting her memories back, though. Listen to me. Matthew. Matthew. You don't have to do this. Wait. You don't belong to them. This is not who you are. It's good to see you. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Yeah. No! Well, she said they always do tend to try and come after them. Well, mic drop. Yep. <laughs> if you knew me at all, you'd know I always win. Mm. Well, that ended that uh, battle real quick. Oh, size again. You know you want them. Mr. Rand, I know I speak for all of us when I say how nice it is to have you with us again. That's impossible. You destroyed it. I saw. You saw what you wanted to see. The truth is, you and I, we're not so different. We share the same home. And this is the end. You'll do what everyone else does for me. What? You'll serve. Oh. Where are you taking me? Well, now that he's taken care of, we can proceed as planned. Do not underestimate me. Kill Luke Cage. Kill Jessica Jones. And the devil of Hell's Kitchen, whoever he is. And only true leader. Oh! Whoa! I didn't see that coming. Oh! What the fuck? It, Holy shit! 
I am completely gagged. Oh my god. <laughs> Did oh. not see any of that. What, what the, the fuck? fuck? I that mean, it was, it was like it. trending on an A. It's an A that fucking plus. That got an plus. A plus. <laughs> a on fucking that plus. alone. Shit. Well, damn. I didn't. I, damn. Ooh. I I didn't see Sigourney Weaver not making the ending of the no, show. No, it's only episode six. Six. We still got two, two more. Two more. Holy fuck! What? Sticks dead. Alexander's, Alexander's dead. dead. There's only Electra's back. Uh, Electra's the big bad currently. What? She wants to live forever? But does she want to live? I'm so... I don't know. I don't know. I got nothing. Fuck, okay, so... Mm -mm. I mean, we knew Stick was probably going to die out of everyone because none of the main cast members can die. They have their own shows. Correct. However, I mean, okay, I, I called it. I said Stick was either going to die and then a villain was going to die. I did not think it they was going to be the same fucking, fucking episode. <laughs> yes, two fucking villains. But then I didn't know the, the main big bad. Was she the MacGuffin the entire time? I don't. I mean. And the surprise throw to throw them all is the fact that she's got her memories. Like, all her memories. And... It only took one one half a day of taking a nap on Matt's bed mm-hmm. to get it back. But wow. the really intriguing thing, we had mentioned this at the end of our recap on the previous episode, that both sides were right to be concerned. But I didn't think that it would be that literally both sides would end up having such catastrophic turns of events because of her. Because she, she killed Stick. She laid everybody else out. I mean, so the question is, is Electra going to survive the season? I'm so, because I she's the one know. that doesn't have her own show. However, she is associated with Daredevil. I would hate for him not to have her in his next season. And she's spun off. I mean, she's so good as an actor and as a character... For her not to be on Daredevil, I'm gonna be disappointed. And she, but the thing, and the the thing is, she also has her own spinoff out of Daredevil as well. Right. So it's hopefully it'll be better than Punisher. I I didn't even. Well, uh, let's anyway. talk. Let's break down this episode. Um, How Jessica and Matt scenes uh, are everything. Yes. I just. Whether or not you agree with me, or if you didn't see those sparks <laughs> when they had that head-to-head confrontation, I mean, they it makes well. you wish they were canon. Mm-hmm. It's I really wish they were. Um, and they and work well they as do. a team. They do. I mean, because they, they have the same sensibilities. They're both so salty together mm-hmm. um, and jaded and, you know, but they still have soft spots for the people that they they really care about. Yeah. Um, it's just that Matt chooses to care for his a little bit harder than for she For sure. Does. Well, I would, I would argue that she just keeps it closer to the vest than he does. That's what I'm saying. Like, he, um, his she is would, more she would, She would, she would tear down the city if Trish was in trouble. Also Which true. she did. Which she did. <laughs> she like immediately I mean, is like, we're going. <laughs> I mean, hell, so, when Trish was in trouble with yeah. the Purple Man, come yes. on. She, um, yes. I mean, it's, I love them together. I love. Yes, I, I love their teamwork. I love the fact I, that he played his own theme song that was, at the piano. That was so meta. I, I loved, loved it. it. He's like, give me a minute. <laughs> do, do, do. And it's such a distinct, like, as soon as he hit those three notes, I was like, that's his theme song. <laughs> that's so awesome. I love it. I just, and I love, 
I love Danny and Luke. Their sure. scenes, the the friendship chemistry that what I'm hoping for this season, being totally honest. There's only two more episodes left. True, but what I'm hoping for the end of this season is now that hopefully the hand, at least for a time, will be very well tied off mm-hmm. as a plot device. Yeah, I'm tired of him as a big band. Yeah, I mean, I it's it spanned the whole, it spanned since Daredevil season two mm-hmm. almost. But hopefully with it tied off, we will get to see more of the Danny stuff, Danny dealing with the Kunlun stuff he's going to have to deal with with Davos. Mm-hmm. But we'll also get to see... Danny more realized as the lovable schmuck, because he's a schmuck. He really is a schmuck, but he's uh. been an angsty schmuck, and it just, you can't be, uh. you can't be so aloof and angsty at the same time. It's not, it's just not working for him in this series. But when he's a lovable schmuck, it's like, you just want to give him a cookie. And then Luke kind of gives him a cookie. That whole scene where Luke kind of tore him down and then he was kind of sitting there defeated and Luke's like, but I guess it must have hurt to punch a dragon. And he's like, yeah, it kind of did. Yeah. So that type of vibe, I... Ugh. Let's talk about Danny for a hot second. I, I think you're giving him, in this particular episode, it wasn't about angst or aloofness. He was being a child. Like, that was a thing I, I was trying to say earlier during that whole scene in the warehouse or whatever that building was. He was t- throwing a tantrum because the big kids wouldn't let him play with them. You know, he couldn't play with the big kids. The big kids are, like, you know, going off and doing the fun thing, and he wants to do the fun thing with the kids. And he's kind of throwing this old temper tantrum in his own little way, and it just... I know it's within his character, I guess, because of him being so naive and not grown up in his own way. But, man, does it just kind of grate on you? It, it grates on me because it's just like like what Luke said. You're, you're trying to beat up people that are on your side. Yes. To, and, and, course... and wanting to just do it differently and because you don't agree with us and you're so one side. He's about as, one, as narrow-minded as... Alexa- Alexandra. Yes. I mean, and it's so frustrating. It's kind of like when I hope there's some character growth in the next season of Iron Fist. Because it is, a, it's fresh. The frustrating thing, I think, is when he is shown those moments where. And it's, I'm trying to figure out how to put this in words. It's the fact that he doesn't learn. Danny doesn't learn the lesson in the first place. Well, okay, does he not learn the lesson or does he just not care to, like, because he's not a stupid character. I think no. he knows what the lesson is. He just doesn't want to acknowledge it because it's not within something he agrees with. He's unwilling to accept <laughs> I think that's the... other points of view unless they are aligned with his own. And mm. I, it just gets... It's out he of his just, it's own like he, he, world view. Right, and it's hard to picture him as a leader yeah, with that definitely. kind of mentality, let alone leading an entire series for a second season. Um, again, he's got to He's got I to grow he up some. He's got to. Maybe. We'll see. We, he made a couple of steps forward in the dinner scene. So. Um, where he became a little likable. And then when he gets those tantrum-esque things, it's just kind of the way that actor's doing it. Mm-hmm. That just bugs the shit out of me. I don't know why. It's frustrating. It just does. I'm just like, why? It's different when Matt does it yeah. or Jessica does it. But when he does it, I, I just it grates on me on like the worst level. Mm-hmm. And I just want to turn it off. It's so sad. Um, Poor Stick. I know. Like... Uh, a moment of silence for Stick. Hmm. That's sad. I like that actor. Badassness of fight scenes. For sure. I did not see that coming with the decapitation. <laughs> At all. <Mm-mm. laughs> Holy shit. I didn't see a lot of things coming. We got some pretty um, gruesome deaths. As far as ninja deaths, but still. Yeah. And wasn't expected when we were... And it was... Kudos 
to how they twisted it. Because we were all sitting here thinking the she'll be back to herself when she finally realizes and takes up her size. And then she took up her size, showing that she fully realized and remembered her memories. But she didn't return to being the Electra from Daredevil at all. So, or did she? Or did she? Is it just going to be one of those like anti-heroes of always fighting against their nature? That's a good question. Um, I can watch that. Because, I mean, she's been an anti-hero very often in the comic. Mm-hmm. So it's just we're currently in the more wild, Bad, uncontrolled yeah. side. So. It'll be interesting. Um, what other pairings were there? Matt and Danny. God, I hate talking about Danny because he's not my favorite character, but he seemed to have been all over this episode. So, again, that big brother, little brother dynamic. Mm -hmm. Um, I can only hope that Matt rubs off on him just a little bit. Not all of his angst because, Lord knows, they have enough of it. But just the way he's matured a little bit. Mm -hmm. Um, But, yeah, I like that scene, too. Yeah. And I love that, the you know, outside of... Matt not having the iron fist, they pretty much can hold their own punches. Yeah. Like, if, if, I feel like if Danny didn't ever have the iron fist, Matt would probably beat his ass. Yeah. You know what that reminds me of? I mean, thank God Jessica knocked his ass out. We're waiting for that. Yes. That reminded me, actually, to show comparison of like the early, early Flash crossovers with Arrow, um, with Matt basically feeling. Oliver's role and then Danny filling a much more frustrating version of Barry's role and the fact that Barry's got power and everything else but Oliver's got the experience and in this case it's kind of the same thing yes Mm -hmm. you've been trained most of your life but you haven't had applicable experience for except for what this is probably supposed to be set months within Iron Fist yeah so maybe several months of actually fighting the hand versus He's not only fought street-level gangsters for years, but has actually been fighting the hand longer than you have. For sure. And I think for the difference is Danny has lost a lot because of the hand, but he didn't... He wasn't there when it happened. Right. Like, well, technically, he was a child, but you know how, like, Matt literally had to survive it. Yeah. He was living through it. Danny was raised within a colony of monks and was given, like was named the fist, the iron fist. Mm -hmm. So he he was kind of removed from that pain because he didn't know it until after he came back to the city and then he realized how much the hand had taken from him. But those relationships weren't there necessarily. He had them way back when he was a child and he was kind of forming them again. So he really just has to live through... Like he's like saying, I have all these people, we care more than... XYZ and about the city and he's like saying it because it's the right thing to say and he he might feel it on some level Mm -hmm. but with Matt he feels it like Hell's Kitchen is his home yes I mean he fucking defended it from Kingpin (laughs) he fucking defended it I mean he just he's always defending it and Danny just jumped into the game right and yet he expects everyone to bow to him right because he's Iron Fist and I think that's another reason why just he kind of grates on me Mm -hmm. Um, because he just it's like that privilege. Maybe that's why he grates on me because he is. There's this privilege and air to him that he's like, you guys should do what I say because I'm Iron Fist. <laughs> like, it's, but he hasn't so necessarily earned it. He hasn't it's, necessarily earned it. He's earned it. It's a but he hasn't earned that's, it. That's that's actual. That's there. That that I think hasn't been. It's been called out yet. It hasn't at the same yeah, time. I mean, Luke but called him out on it. Luke called him out on it. Stick has actually called him out right. on it. Everybody's but really he doesn't him out learn. On it. He he doesn't even acknowledge it. He like listens and hears it, but then he doesn't even absorb it to then pra- like to then go. Oh, maybe I should be a little bit more aware mm-hmm. of how I show it. Right. Because that whole fight, that whole like argument he had with all three of them, the privilege he feels of being Iron Fist, and because the hand took so much away from him, the hand took a lot away from Matt. Yes. I mean, fuck. And he doesn't even real. He doesn't even empathize with Matt at all on mm-hmm. any any level. The, Jessica empathizes with Matt. She yeah. actually brought up his past. Yes. And that's why I love them together. That I mean, I feel like the more we talk about it, this is the things that grate on me about Danny. Mm-hmm. There's just this whole like not getting it 
and he thinks he gets it. And he's like, no, you don't no. get it at all. Uh, Please, writers, can you just lighten up on him being that way? Like, give him a little bit of empathy and some... Yes. Let the world experience maturity. sink in. Yes. Because the sad part is, even in the latter scene with Alexandra, rest in peace, mm. um, or wherever. Um, <laughs> no, she did. <laughs> she, uh, I was like, rest in well, she did. not rest in glory. She's kind of oh, she been did. evil the whole season. But anyway, with but yeah, even with that series, and it points it out even more so because the sad thing is he can't even understand the similarities there when they're again pointed out, and especially as we're going to these last two episodes where he's going to learn. <laughs> Holy shit, I am the key. Yeah, like even then he was unwilling to even accept that as a possibility. Mm-hmm. It just. Damn, at least Dawn accepted her keenness. For sure. Oh my god. I mean, is it bad can we do, we need to we, we need Dawn? to stop. Yes. <laughs> and Dawn was fucking annoying to me. I did not like the character of Dawn. I liked that actress. I did not like Dawn. She grew on me a little bit after. But that season when she was the key and she was like a teenage brat. Yeah. Oh my god. And that's kind of what he is. But he's Oh wrong. man, he's just I get there faster writers. With Big Danny, him. please, when it's season two of Iron Fist, please get there faster. Because if I have to watch him be the same way, I'm not going to finish an entire season. Even as much as I love Colleen, I just I can't watch that. Can we have some Misty crossover in season yeah, two? Maybe. I would, I would love that. I want some Daredevil Jessica Jones crossover. Jessica Jones and a Daredevil and yes. vice versa now that they're buddies. I would love that. Yes. More world more, mixing just all yes, over the right? place. right? Like, even if Luke Cage came in a Daredevil or, like, just, like, little itty-bitty appearances of one or two episodes, mm-hmm. maybe. If um, if Foggy's firm is helping them to deal with this, the Mariah Dillard situation, mm-hmm. you know, whatever. I just, I, I love that they're actually blending the yeah. world, so I just want to see it. Even more. And we got only two more episodes that we're not going to get to watch until later. <sighs> but when we get them, we'll bring them to you. Yes. All right, guys. That does it for us. If you Please like this. Like, video, this. like, subscribe, comment below, share with your friends. I know we made this pretty long and a lot of it was about Danny, which, God, why? I can't. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> All right. That does it for us. That does it for us. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.